This dinosaur was discovered by accident and is said to be 110 million years old. Once, a digger discovered something unusual, which led to a revelation that stunned every scientist. But what they discovered next was so massive and old that it was preserved in a museum. In an extraordinary find, scientists have shown what is thought to be the best preserved dinosaur specimen ever discovered. Interestingly, the petrified nodosaur's skin and armor remain intact, hiding its bones. Despite its age of more than 110 million years, the dinosaur looks to have perished only a few weeks ago, demonstrating its amazing preservation. Miners in Alberta, Canada, discovered this nodosaur by mistake. The Royal Tyrrell Museum of Paleontology, located in the same area, reported the discovery, noting the specimen's excellent preservation. Unlike other dinosaur fossils, which show skeletal remnants, this nodosaur is so well preserved that it resembles a dinosaur mummy rather than a fossil. The quality of preservation astounded the experts who examined the nodosaur. The dinosaur's armor, skin, and even some internal organs survived intact, a rare occurrence in paleontology. The journey from discovery to museum exhibition took six years, a short time in comparison to the 110 million years since the dinosaur's extinction during the early Cretaceous period. When a miner discovered it, the museum personnel were notified right away, which prompted a strict excavation and preservation process. During its peak, the nodosaur was fashioned like a tank. It belonged to a newly found species and was a large, four-legged ruminant armored with spikes and plates. The dinosaur weighed over 3,000 pounds in life, and even when mummified, it weighs about 2,500 pounds. This form of ankylosaur had a strong build and was adapted to protect itself in its Cretaceous home, which had a climate comparable to modern-day Florida. One of the most remarkable characteristics of this nodosaur is the preservation of its stomach contents. Analysis indicated that the dinosaur was a herbivore that preferred ferns over other vegetation. The stomach contents were matched to fossil leaf studies from the same time period, demonstrating the nodosaur's specialized diet. The finding of real preserved stomach contents is unusual and gives crucial information about the dinosaur's feeding habits and habitat. The nodosaur's stomach included 48 pollen and spore microfossils from moss and liverwort, 26 club mosses and ferns, 2 flowering plants, and 13 conifers. This finely defined botanical image contributes to our knowledge of ancient ecosystems by providing a window into the flora that was there at the time of the dinosaurs. The riddle of how the dinosaur stayed so intact for millions of years continues to captivate scholars. One theory is that the nodosaur was swept away by a flooded river, finally being taken out to sea and sank to the ocean floor. Minerals are expected to have collected on the dinosaur's skin and armor over millions of years, retaining its realistic appearance. It is thought that the dinosaur lay on the ocean floor, enabling minerals to progressively replace its organic components. The species has been called Boreal Apelta Mark Mitchell I after Mark Mitchell, a museum personnel who played an important role in its preparation. The fossil was first encased in a 15,000-pound boulder and carefully transferred to the museum. Over 7,000 hours of precise labor were put into separating the skin and bone from the surrounding rock, displaying the nodosaur in all its magnificence. The researchers used mass spectrometry methods to identify pigments in the dinosaur's skin, revealing the color. The nodosaur's skin was dark reddish-brown on the upper side and paler beneath. The color most likely acted as camouflage, keeping the herbivore safe from the era's life-threatening predators. An excavator operator working in an oil sands mine made the unexpected find. The ensuing efforts to recreate the dinosaur lasted thousands of hours, culminating in the specimen's public display. The preservation is so amazing that the dinosaur mummy retains its three-dimensional form, offering a unique and important view of its original shape. This discovery not only advances paleontology but also improves our understanding of dinosaur biology and behavior.
The intact armor and chemical remains on the nodosaur might provide information on its color patterns and probable activities, such as mating displays. The capacity to investigate such well-preserved bones enables scientists to recreate elements of dinosaur life that are typically lost to history. The Nodosaur's fortuitous discovery and subsequent preservation demonstrate the surprising nature of paleontological discoveries, as well as their ability to transform our knowledge of prehistoric life. The Boreal Appel to Mark Mitchell I exemplifies the amazing preservation conditions that may occur under certain settings, offering an unusual glimpse into the ancient past.